Hello again. The next uh, series, uh, based on uh, a character re recurring, are the books by John Sanford featuring Lucas Davenport, usually known as the Prey series because they've uh, usually got Prey in the title somewhere. <clears throat> Excuse me. John Sanford is um, a nom de plume of um, a chap called John Camp who has written some other series of books. Uh, but as John Sanford, uh, he's best known for the Prey series. Uh, Lucas Davenport is a Minneapolis police officer, detective, uh, in the earlier books. And uh, the, one of the books is an origin book, uh, which is in... Um, different phases where it goes, there's a, uh, the bodies are found, um, which are, are two uh, young girls who've been missing for many years. And they're finally found. And it goes back to uh, Lucas Davenport's first involvement in the case when he was a patrol officer. And then the up-to-date investigation and so on, and it's linked. And it's really fascinating how he gets into being a detective. And um, he has um, various co-workers with him um, uh, as a detective. And he uh, is quite senior and he runs uh, his own little outfit, an intelligence uh, outfit, where basically he gets to pick and choose what he wants to do because he's uh, very wealthy. He, he, he got into gaming, um, uh, com computer games and simulations and uh, came out with uh, the software for a police uh, simulation training um, program, which made him a lot of money. So he doesn't really have to do the job. So um, from uh, being a Minneapolis PD detective, uh, his boss uh, takes over the state agency, the BCA, Bureau of Criminal Apprehension. And he um, joins them. So several of the books are where he's working at a state level. And one of his detectives uh, is Virgil Flowers. And there's a whole series of books based uh, on him, uh, which are also really, really good. Then he, um, he, he becomes very friendly with the governor of the state because he, he is in investigated some stuff for him and the governor is making a political run anyway he ends up um, leaving the BCA uh, Lucas and uh, becoming a US Marshal which then gives him um, the scope of operating all over the country including um, I think a couple of the future books may go, even go internationally and while he's, as, as a marshal, he um, has two compatriots from the Marshal's Special Operations Group, uh, male and female, and um, he works with them. And they're his kind of uh, heavy hitters. And he, he had a similar two when he was working um, at the BCA. So um, the progress or the progression uh, has been very, very interesting. Um, John Sanford, I think he based Lucas Damport on a real character, a police a police detective who made his money from Cordon Bleu cooking or something like that, and was also a um, black belt in, in martial arts. So there's a kind of basis of uh, reality there. But um, the... Uh, the way that he he keeps the um, his output is prodigious, and, and he keeps producing these books, not just the prey books, but other ones, and the quality never never lags. They've they've all been exceptional. Um, a couple of them uh, within the series are also linked. He, he introduced a female uh, hit woman assassin who worked for organized crime called Carmel Lone in a, in a book and then followed up sometime later uh, in 
probably my favourite of, of the books. Um, and the first Carmel Lone book was actually filmed um, called Certain Prey, and it's starring Mark Harmon as Lucas Davenport. They didn't do a bad job. They stuck to the book pretty well. The actress playing Carmel Lone, she, she went on to... Um, to star in, in, in a, in a, 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 um, quite a, a well-known series later. And um, she did a really good job. And as I say, they stuck more or less to the plot. And uh, I, I enjoyed Certain Prey. Thought Mark Harmon was good as Lucas Davenport. Um, and then, as, as I say, the, the Carmel Lone character comes back in Mortal Prey. They didn't film it, but it was a, a super book. Um, the books can be rather gruesome. Um, some of the characters are, are just horror comics uh, completely. Um, there's there's a, a female torturer uh, in, in one. There's um, a, a gang of um, Mexican sicarios who um, torture, rape and kill a family. Um, and in one of the recent ones, there's a, a guy who, uh, it, it's not his main thing, but he ha happens to be a cannibal. He likes to barbecue dead uh, humans, but he, he's um, a, a criminal as well. And um, the books have kept me gripped oh, many, many, many years. And uh, there's a new one coming out um, in a few weeks' time, and I'm really looking forward to that. Um, so... I really do recommend uh, John Sanford's uh, Prey series featuring Lucas Davenport.